All right, Coach, uh, good two wins here. Give me your thoughts on the overall on the day. Um, bats came alive, so that's always a good thing. Started to become contagious. Um, and we had production from multiple people in the lineup throughout the doubleheader. Um, I liked some of our strong pitching performances, and we had some very good uh, defensive moments. So um, we're starting to play night softball, which uh, again, which is awesome. Yeah, a lot of diversity. Was starting with obviously Chloe Evans in the first game it was unbelievable. Hit the big three run homer, and that great throw to third to run, throw out the base runner. Just talk about her setting that tone in that first game. Yeah, huge, huge. Because um, the night before, um, you know, she, I thought her last at bat. Uh, with the deep fly ball, I, I told her afterwards, I said, that at bat's going to pay off tomorrow. And when she came, you know, up in those clutch situations and um, got the results she did, I was like, ah, made me look smart, girl. So, um, I mean, it's just, again, her believing and sticking to the process. Uh, she's a competitor. She's feisty and hungry. And um, she definitely wants to help produce and have impact for the team. Jasmine Williams, who put her back in the leadoff spot, kind of paid off. Solo homers to start games in both games there. Yeah. Had a perfect night in the second game. Just talk about her back in the leadoff spot. Um, made me look smart again, you know. They're, they're doing a good job of that. Uh, yeah, I just, you know, I, I do like how she produces um, in the six and se six and seven hole um, and keeps the momentum going for our lineup. But I just felt like for our, you know, start the game off and kind of in that spot of seeing more pitches, um, even if it was like first or second pitch home run, but um, just seeing more pitches and kind of putting the momentum in our hands. Jazz is such a cool, calm um, player and really a rhythm player. And so I, I love how she kind of gets the rhythm to us. And I mean, she's our mama bear. So um, she takes care of us and sets the tone. Sarah Willis gave you a great outing in the first game to get the win, and in the second game you go with Felton, followed by DeVoe, and then Grace Jewell was fantastic in closing the game. Just talk about your pictures overall today. Yeah, they're starting to gel together. Um, you know, both of those teams that we face uh, today and with Toledo again last night, they can hit the ball. They put the ball in play. They're very um, just to contact, and so it was tough. You know, like we, I'm like, okay, is that ball out? And yeah, it's out. I said, okay, well, we'll keep going. So to be able to gel the way we did and mix the pitchers the way we did to keep the momentum in our hands is awesome. And again, pitching to our defense. You know, we, we've had a lot of moments where we've had more strikeouts in games, but I would much rather less strikeouts and less walks if we can. So. Michaela had the big tri triple there with the yeah. bases loaded, driving in three runs, and then Aubrey with five RBIs in the second game. Just talk about those two there, because you're kind of splitting them a little bit at second base there, and you're kind of being versatile right now. Yeah, I mean, Lala is who Lala is. You know, she's always a, a big time player in, in those big time moments, um, but she can do a lot of things, and she's shown her power this year, which is awesome. Um, and so it's just keeping people healthy, um, keeping the com them competing, um, and not getting stagnant in their, you know, their position. So um, I like how they're being feisty and competing. That's who we are. We're gritty. Um, we're disruptors. And so they continue to exude uh, that mentality. Quick turnaround now. You got North Dakota and then Kennesaw again on Sunday. What's the approach like with a kind of a quick turnaround? Yeah, we're going to go in and scout as a staff. Um, North Dakota is somebody that puts the ball in play, so uh, we expect that game to be, uh, you know, just a, a lot of excitement. Um, and then, obviously, Kennesaw State can put the ball in play, and I feel like we've seen quite a few of their pitchers. So um, I'm excited to see how we, you know, respond with what we did today and continue to get better each game. All right, congrats, Coach, of the Twins. Thank you very much.